Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Susan. If you like, you can call me Sue. Um, welcome back to another video, another vlog. Today we are going shopping. Today is on Saturday. So we are going to Isili. Isili is one of those places that you can shop in Nairobi. I plan to bring you along and I'm hoping that you will enjoy this episode. I'm hoping that you will come, come along with us. Wait, not just shopping. We will be exploring Isili as I show you the neighborhoods and how Isili actually looks like, what goes on at Isili and why Isili. And currently we are at KCA on Thika Road. This is KCA University and this is Thika Road. It's around uh, 20 minutes to Isili. Yeah, 20 minutes to Isili from here. So guys, I'm hoping that you enjoyed this episode. Kindly hit that like button, subscribe and come along with us. So this is Thika Road around Pangani area and we're just getting into traffic on a Saturday. Did I say this is Pangani? Yes, so this is Pangani. It's been growing really fast with all these high-rise buildings. Um, I think it's because this area is just close to town. It's very close to town. So the fact that it's really close to town, people want to really live here because it won't take less time. It won't take much time to go to town, especially those who work in town. So we left Thika Road and then we entered Pangani Estates. So this is inside the estate. I can safely say that this is a middle class neighborhood estate in Nairobi. Yes, this is the these are the residential, these are residential place where Nairobians live, typical. So Kitambo, like in earlier years, this place was dominated by the Asian communities, especially the Indian people. And then nowadays this place has been like the bungalow form of housing was demolished or is still being demolished and they are building these high-rise buildings right now. Um, and that came about because of affordable housing that was introduced by the president sometimes back. So maybe sometimes in the future, uh, all these buildings, all these uh, shorter buildings that you see may be demolished and then this place will have only the high-rise buildings. Does this place look like New York? New York? Let me know in the comments section. If you come from New York or if you visited New York, uh, let me know if uh, the way this place is coming up looks like New York. So the route we used that is through inside Pangani Estate is a shortcut to Isili. Otherwise, there is another route that goes directly to Isili. Also, if you are coming from town and you are going to Isili, there are matatus that transport people from Nairobi CBD all the way to Isili. And yes, this is a typical residential estate or area where Kenyans live. This is how they look like normally. You know, flats. Yeah. So this part, we're just joining Juja Road. So we just joined Juja Road. So yes, um, this place is for middle class Kenyans. This is where middle class Kenyans live. One of the places that is not all middle class. Can you just live here? Yeah. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you think about the video. Guys, 
so we went looking for parking. We're currently at Juja Road, just entering Isili. So you might be wondering, so why is Isili so special? Well, it's not special, but there's something you should know about it. So Isili is a neighborhood in Nairobi, both commercial and residential, that has been dominated by the Somali people. Rather, this is where most Somali people live. Like um, 90% of the population in this place is by the Somalis and Ethiopians, a few Ethiopians. So we are coming from the more residential side of Isili. We are going to the more commercial side of Isili. Now that is where we have the malls. Yeah, we have the malls and people selling stuff. And it is the most congested part of Isili as well. So we've walked for like 20 minutes. The reason we've walked so far is because um, parking can be stressful here and you can see there's a lot of traffic it's so hard to maneuver so most businesses in this place are owned by the somali community and most products come from mogadishu and dubai and most of them are clothes jewelry um camel milk and stuff like kitchen appliances yeah so basically it's a big market dominated by malls you will notice a lot of malls you will see us getting into malls and get coming out of malls so yes and did i mention that this place is really busy yes this place is ever 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 really busy This is one of the hardest places to film. It's not easy. We are looking for men, men's clothes. So, this mall has kids and women's clothes and bugs. We're looking for men, men's clothes. So, all these are women's clothes and shoes and bags and kids' clothes. We're looking for men's clothes, so we're going to check out another mall. Here also, I see more of women's clothes than men's clothes. But generally, I feel like women's clothes are sold more than men's clothes. What do you think? We're just leaving another mall because only women's clothes. We're looking for men's clothes and we're outside. And it's really risky to film out here. So this place also has clothes for women and kids. Thank you. 
Oh, so guys, we found we finally found a place with men's clothes. This place. <laughs> Asante. <laughs> so I think we finally found a place with men's clothes. This mall has more men's clothes. Welcome. Uh, Nio on a tafuta. Yeah, so I think we finally found a mall with men's clothes. It is so hard to get men's clothes in these shops. As in easy malls, zote ni kama ziko na nguza watoto na wanawake ya kuna nguza men. Ziko? Kido. Mm. So guys, I have wanted to do a, in, an Isili vlog for such a long time, but it's so hard filming in Isili alone. So today I finally found the perfect opportunity. I decided to follow people to come shop with them as I film for you guys. I hope you are liking this video so far. We are in a, um, we are in a men's shop. They are trying out clothes. I'm waiting for them to try out clothes so that we go. Yeah. And don't mind this. Hey, we found one trouser. So the search continues. Welcome back from Kenya. Yes, there's a video. Where are we? Do a video. So we found a trouser. We're now looking for a shirt or a t shirt. We're in this shop. Uh, it has coats, everything. I'm waiting for them to negotiate.
Here they only have women's bags. Nice. Nice. Yes, yeah, so guys, um, this is where to shop for men's clothes. Where do you shop for your clothes? If you're a guy and you're watching this video, where do you shop for your clothes? Let me know down in the comments below. And we've been shopping for guys' clothes. I think now we're done. So we will be heading out next. If you need perfumes, clothes, especially variety of clothes, you get them from Italy. We're done shopping, so we're now going to we're now going to we're now going back home. Yeah. So let me know what you think about the video, guys. Let me know if you like the video. Let me know where you do your shopping. Let me first show you some home appliances here. They look so good. So yeah, so guys, let me know where you do your shopping. And... Done with shopping. What do you guys think about Italy? How was your shopping experience? Oh, Benson. Uh, my experience, yeah. the, the, there's a lot of variety in ladies, ladies items, like if you're looking for dresses, if you're looking for handbags, if you're looking for shoes, especially for ladies, that is available in plenty. Um, for the gents, you have to really dig through the shops. You have to really search through the shops to find what you're looking for. But there's a few shops that are specializing in gentlemen's clothes. And it wasn't very hectic. It's too hot at the moment. But um, the, 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 whatever we got was fairly priced. Um, I think it's, it's, it's good. Um, the experience was smooth. I can't complain. Just that there's not a very wide variety for gentlemen's items. Yeah, that's true. There are so many things for ladies and kids and few things for and Unless men. if someone knows where the hidden shops and hidden spots are, and they can tell us in the comments. Yes, if you know Isili and you're a gentleman and you normally shop here, let us know where you normally shop because oh, it was it was not easy finding those shops that are dealing with men's men's clothing. Anyway, guys, we are going back to the car. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did, and. And we'll be ending the vlog here. See you in the next one. Bye. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Okay. Bye.